And good morning, I'm Kristen Bean. If you take a look, school bus drivers in Elkhart are just about to get on the road this morning. And there are a lot of new drivers this year. Coming up, we're going to introduce you to one. And Kristen, when students head back to school, that also means it's time to get updated on all those vaccines. But several students in our area are now saying they're getting sick from their shots. Good morning again. I'm Bob Montgomery. We'll hear what doctors think about that. First, fast, accurate. You're watching WSBT Channel 22 News. First thing in the morning. It is 6.30 on this Friday morning, and if you live in Elkhart, you'll notice a lot of buses on the roads this morning. Elkhart Community Schools will welcome students back today. It's the first day of school there, and for people who take the bus, there are some changes they'll need to know about. WSBT's Kristen Bean is in Elkhart this morning. Kristen, there are a lot of new drivers driving those school buses this year. Yeah, and a lot of new routes and even some changed routes. So there are going to be some rough moments today for the start of school and as we go, you know, maybe in the coming week or so. But take a look behind me. You can see that uh, most of the school bus drivers this morning are getting ready to leave or they're already leaving. So uh, watch out if you're on the road. But most of the drivers are like Terry Cochran. He's a new driver we met yesterday. And if all the drivers are like him, the kinks that you'll see this morning will be worked out real quickly. The wall of keys at the transportation office for Elkhart Community Schools was full. But this morning, those keys are gone. It's because today is the first day of school and all 137 buses are on the roads. Which will actually make the lights flash. Terry Cochran is a school bus driver. Today is his first day. Because safety of the kids is, is utmost. It's the most important. We're also going to check the mechanics. Last year, the school district announced they were hiring new drivers. A lot of new drivers. More than a dozen drivers retired and routes were added. This year, nearly a quarter of the district's bus drivers are new. Transportation Director Henry Lohmeyer says they hired a good mix of people. Safety, dependent a uh, good clean motor vehicle record, good character, and the ability to, uh, the desire to work with students. And what better choice than a retired police officer and pastor like Cochran? Yeah, I'm glad I did. It's going to be fun. 